In this video, we're going to look at how you can add your organization's logo to your account as well as customize your homepage branding and PDF branding. Um, to add your logo, you can do that directly through the homepage right here just by clicking on the plus sign. Um, basically, when you click on the browse button, um, you can um, navigate to the place in your uh, on your computer where you've got your logo and then you can just upload it and it will display not only right here in the home page but in the heading of all your PDFs. Um, you can also customize the branding text right there. So we're going to quickly customize that. And again, this branding text and the logo is going to show on the home page um, or the home dashboard of all your um, users in your account. I'm going to edit this a little bit more. And the logo is also going to display um, in the um, heading of all the emails that are sent out from your system also. And we'll cover that in another video. You can also go to the settings area right here and go to the organization logo right here. Uh, and here's also where you can upload or download, upload your logo or download it and delete it once you've uploaded it. Um, that's where you can manage the logo. You can also manage um, your PDF customization right here. Um, by default, we pull information from the account owner's profile in the contacts area um, to display it in the PDF header, um, but you can change that in this area right here. First of all, you can specify if you want the header to center, um, align left, align right. You can also customize your footer text for, and this is for all of the PDFs that are downloaded out of your account. Um, um, here is the uh, pre-built header, and again, this is information that pulls from the account owner's profile in the contacts area. This is the default setting. Um, you can turn some of these things on and off if you don't want them to display from the owner's area. However, you can also completely customize the header by going to the setup custom header area. And once you start entering um, text into this area, um, we will use whatever you enter here as your default header information for all of the PDFs that are downloaded from your account. So we're gonna, uh, you can uh, add some um, customization to that. Here is our header information. So now I'm gonna download a PDF to show you what this looks like. I'm gonna go into one of my events and I'm just gonna download the, uh, the contact, the signed contact list PDF from the event right here. Um, and there are uh, dozens and dozens of places where you can download PDFs from inside of your account. And here is what the header would look like. So you can see um, it's got my logo that I uploaded a few minutes ago, as well as the customized information that's included in the, in the header. Here's the customized footer information that I added just a few minutes ago. So that's how you can customize your homepage branding. Uh, you can customize your PDF headers and footers, and you can upload your logo to display in a variety of places inside of your account. Uh, thanks for watching. Just let us know if you have any questions.